Hello, I'm Jennifer Caruso, and I just got back from Disney World. Uh, I went there for a special trip to um, look at and purchase the Epcot 40th anniversary merchandise that I wanted, and I'm really excited to show it to you. So um, let's just start with the Epcot Magic Band. This is so pretty. I loved all the colors in this, and I didn't use it yet. My cousin actually bought one last night, and she did use it, and it was great. With Harmonious, it turned all the colors. It kept up with the show, whatever color was going on. The band was turning the colors. Um, it worked really well. There was a software update to do on it, and it seemed like the band was working really, really well, better than I've seen them work. So if you get a new band, a Magic Plus band, um, definitely make sure you put the software update on it. So that's exciting. I got one for my husband too. <laughs> um, the next favorite thing of mine is the Epcot 40th pin. This is a very large pin. Um, I bought it because I think it's going to be a collectible. Pretty sure I have a son, Nikki, who loves Disney, and um, I think he'll really enjoy this pin uh, in years to come, and he'll take good care of it. Um, so I, I did get it. It was a little bit expensive. I do have a season pass, so I got the 30%. Pass holder discount, uh, but here it is. It has figment on it. There's a little bit of a reflection here, but hopefully you can see um, it has figment on it and it says Epcot 40th. So that's that pin. Um, let me grab my bag. I did get the lounge fly and I love it. Look at those colors. The colors are so pretty on it, and it does have the front pocket on it, which is really kind of a must for me um, to put my things that I want access to really quick when I'm in the park. The downside to this bag, though, is it doesn't have the side pockets. It looks like there's side pockets, but they don't open. So um, no side pockets on the bag. It does have the double zipper. It has the beautiful purple straps. Um, the bag is a little smaller than normal bags. So let me move back here and see if I can give you a shot of these two bags um, together. So you can see, this is my other lounge fly bag that I use quite a bit in the parks. And if you look at them back to back, um, you can really see um, the size the size difference and the depth of the bag. This one also has the side pockets. They open. You can I put an umbrella actually in there. You can put a phone in one if it's nice and tight. Um, it has the bigger uh, front pocket. And so just know that if you decide you're gonna get the Epcot 40th bag, it's not quite as big as most of the lounge flies, but I did get a lot in it. Um, I was able to get, you know, pretty much everything I needed in this bag. So I'm gonna use it. I know a lot of people are getting these, they're gonna put them on a shelf and collect them um, because it is white and it probably will get dirty but I'm gonna use it and I'm gonna enjoy it. And when I'm finished, I'll clean it up as best I can and then I'll put it on the shelf. So that's the Epcot 40th bag. And look at the colors. Aren't the colors so pretty? Look at it with the magic band. So that's gonna look awesome wearing it together. Uh, the next thing that I have are um, pins. And we have um, a pin holder and it actually comes with a starter pin that says Epcot 40th and this is to put all of your pins on. So I did buy a good many pins. I'm going to show you the pins here. All right, the first pin that I have 
is so pretty. It's so colorful. It is figment and it's a limited edition and it says Epcot 40 it's on it and um, just really pretty. This pin was $17.99 and it was 30% off, but I really like the colors in it. The other pin that I got um, was this one and it has motion. I love the pins with motion. And let me get this opened up for you. Horizons is on the inside. So that is a really cool pin. And it just closes up like this. This one was $19.99. It was a little bit more, but I really like it. Then I went and I got, I wanted to collect a pin from each country. And I ran around and I found the pins from all but two. I missed two and they were in a different spot. And I can't believe I knew that and I didn't go back. I was gonna go back and get them and I forgot. So I've gotta go back to Epcot for sure and uh, get Mexico and Morocco. Um, but here is Canada and that's Chippendale. Uh, this is the World Showcase pins. Next, you have the UK, and um, you've got Tigger and Eeyore on there. They're very cute. Um, here you have Remy for France and the Eiffel Tower. Um, let's see what we want to do next. So we have... Um, the American Adventure. You have Mickey and Minnie on there. It's really a cute pin. And there's a little bit reflection. I know I haven't taken these out of the, the wrapper yet. Um, here is Japan. With Stitch. Pinocchio for Italy. I love the characters too on the pins I mean they didn't have to put characters on the pins they could have just showed the world showcase the buildings but I love it that they put characters on the pins that were that went together with um, the country here's Norway and we have Olaf from Frozen which is fitting Here is China. And we have Goofy for Germany. So the pins are really nice. I really, really like the pins and I can't wait um, to put them all on this uh, display board. So I also got some shirts and this, well, this is actually a hoodie and i'll just show it to you here let me move back a little bit so you can see it it's the 40 and 40th anniversary of cod hoodie um it's not a zip up it's a pullover i like the zip ups but i have some of those so i thought oh i'll get this pullover one and on the back is our favorite figment so this is really nice and it's not really heavy. It's not fleece inside. It's like a terry material on the inside and um, makes it a nice weight just to wear in the house with the air conditioning to restaurants or to Disney on a cool night. Uh, this is um, a, a long sleeve tee, which mm -hmm. I really liked. Um, it says Epcot 40th on it and on the back you have all those colors all those beautiful colors and look at this look how nice that looks with the magic band i just love how all this stuff coordinates and it looks so nice together and then yes i got a lot i know but i was ready for this i was planning on it it was planned i knew i was gonna purchase a lot of this merchandise and so um, that's that. <laughs> Here is the spirit jersey. 
I'm not really a big fan of spirit jerseys. Um, I don't wear them that often, but this is a 40th jersey. It's nice and lightweight. It's not real heavy at all. It's great for Florida. Um, on the back, you have all those beautiful colors again. Epcot, 40. And um, I think I'll wear this. I think I'll wear this a good bit. Uh, then I got um, tea, a t-shirt, and this is just, you know, just a regular tee, and the back is really, really cute. You have all the colors on it. You have um, celebrating 40 years of imagination with, with figment, and if you kind of look at it with the back, it's gonna look so cute when you have this, when you have this backpack, lounge fly with this shirt. So that pretty much wraps up my Epcot purchases. I do have um, a video on my channel if you'd like to go see uh, the creation store in Epcot. I went all through the creation store and I filmed all of the 40th merchandise. So you can see everything that's there um, in addition to what I brought home. Thank you and uh, hit that subscribe button if you like what you'd see. I'd love to have you in my friends and family channel. Thank you.